Today's video, we'll be discussing a controversial ruling by a Spanish court, which ordered an electrical company to either reinstate a sacked worker or pay them €47,000 for failing to prove that their drinking on the job left them inebriated, intoxicated, or unable to do their job. Drinking alcohol during work hours is usually frowned upon and can constitute grounds for dismissal. But according to the High Court in Murcia, Spain, that is only true when the employer can prove without a shadow of a doubt that the accused was inebriated to the point where they could no longer fulfill their duty safely. In September of 2021, the Spanish electrical company fired an electrician who had been with the company for 27 years after a private detective presented evidence that he had been constantly consuming alcohol on the job over several weeks. The private eye had been hired by the company to observe the sacked employee and his colleagues throughout the day, and he apparently observed them drinking copious amounts of beer all through the day. The electrician's dismissal letter mentions that on one occasion, he and one of his colleagues had been observed stopping for a drink at a bar at 8.27 am. At lunchtime that same day, the two were seen buying some food, four cans of San Miguel beer, and a liter bottle of Estrella de Levant beer. In the afternoon, the electrician was seen drinking another can of beer, and another at around 6.30 pm, before driving a company van back to base. Sorry to interrupt, but before we continue. Please support us by sharing and subscribing to our channel, The American Republic. Your support helps us continue to bring you important stories like this one. Two weeks later, the private detective reportedly saw the electrician and his colleagues drinking a total of seven liters of beer between morning and the end of their lunch break, as well as three cans of beer later in the day, before once again driving the company van. On another occasion, the man was seen drinking a can of beer, followed by three glasses of wine and a shot of pomace brandy. The above evidence seems more than enough to justify the company's decision to dismiss the electrician, but the Mersion High Court disagreed. Ordering the electrical company to either compensate the man or hire him back. The court explained that, at no time did the private detective make mentions of signs of inebriation or clumsiness when it came to walking. There was no proof, documentary, expert, or witness, that unequivocally demonstrated that the man was under the effects of alcohol and was inebriated, intoxicated or drunk. Neither was it proved, even circumstantially, that his physical and mental faculties were reduced or diminished during his tasks as an electrician, nor that he was impeded when he drove the company van at the end of the working day. But the court didn't stop there. Its ruling also mentioned that the company failed to take into consideration that the man indulged in alcoholic drinks with his colleagues and because they were eating and needed refreshments. There was also no way to determine how much each person had drunk and if any of them had become inebriated. Another factor to be borne in mind is that this relates to the month of July in Murcia and Cartagena, where the climatic conditions and the geographical habits should be considered. The court ruling read, there is no proof that drinking beer had any impact on his ability to perform his duties safely or efficiently. This ruling has sparked controversy, and many people are outraged. It is not difficult to understand why. Drinking alcohol on the job is generally unacceptable, and it is hard to imagine a scenario in which it would be permissible. This ruling sends the wrong message and could encourage other employees to behave irresponsibly.